My name is Liz and I'm a hairdresser. And I'm Liz's husband, Sean, and I'm a banker. My daughter's name is Hannah and she's such a wonderful girl. She's kind, loving, and sweet. We have a great relationship. We're best of friends and we do everything together. She brings sunshine into our life every day. We just have one problem. Her boyfriend, Mike, he is a spoiled, rotten brat. Meet Hannah and her boyfriend, Michael. They've been dating for five months and seem like a perfect match. And that really gets to Hannah's mom and dad. Her parents can't stand Michael, so they're picking out two new guys to take Hannah on a date. I know who I'm gonna pick. Okay, I think we got a couple good people. Then they'll sit down with Michael and watch the dates together. When you're getting beat up, you just kind of clench onto the person. <laughs> oh, that's not boxing. That's pretty much standing and dry humping. Oh. No, it's it looks not. like they're having sex. You're letting your daughter have sex on TV. At the end of the day, Hannah will either choose to stay with her boyfriend or trade him out for one of the new guys. Things are about to heat up on parental control. My name's Hannah. My boyfriend's name is Mike. We've been dating for a little while, and he's an awesome guy. He's cute, he's funny, he's silly, he's sensitive. Sometimes he can be a little brat, but I love him. Michael is dumb. I don't understand what Hannah sees in the guy. The guy cannot even put a sentence together. I mean, you look at the guy and there's this blank stare like there's nothing behind those eyes of his. It's like Earth to Mike, Earth to Mike. Yeah, he's got the attention span of a gnat. Uh, I'm actually a pretty smart kid. I just don't like to act smart. I don't know why, but I'm a goofball. I don't know. <laughs> Michael is addicted to text messaging. And that's all he does from the time he walks in the door to the time that he leaves. It's all about that little cell phone of his. There are certain manners that you would think somebody would have, and it bugs me that Hannah puts up with it. I'm always on my phone for business. <laughs> <laughs> in a day, I probably send over a thousand text messages for friends, and I always text family, but I'm just a busy man. <laughs> Michael surfing is really a problem. All Mike thinks about and talks about is surfing. Hannah isn't even a priority at all. The guy comes in here like he's bringing the beach in with all the sand and crap all over the place. And, and then after he's done, he has her wax out surfboard. It pisses me off. I want it to be my career. It just takes a lot of time and dedication. Her dad's always on my case. Right now, can you get that damn thing out of my living room? Oh, come on, dude. Hannah's pants, they're <laughs> annoying pants. <laughs> Hannah is going to go to college, and Michael is not. And I fear for that. If she stays with this guy, it's not going to happen. I can see her sitting on the beach and not doing anything because of the influence he's had on her. Now it's time for mom and dad to meet the potential blind dates for Hannah. Hello. How are you guys doing? Pretty good. How about you? Oh, doing good. Hello. Lisa. Matt. My name's Thor. Nice to meet you. My name is Liz. Marquis. My name is Ante. Ante Sean. Okay, so tell us, um, what do you do for a living? Currently a student studying veterinary science. I, I own a trucking company. I work at a skate shop. Business management. Uh, I'm in construction, actually. I'm an artist. I'm working for an advertising company making commercials. Going to physician's assistant school. I'm an artist. I rap. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. Yo, over here. If you could be anyone in history, who would you be and why? If I could be anyone in history, I think it'd have to be... Who would it be? Oh. No. I'm gonna say Albert Einstein. Chris Rock. Abraham Lincoln. <sighs> Luke Skywalker. Blew up the Death Star, man. Come on. Uh, I think I'd be my grandpa. Why is that? My grandma's pretty hot. Um... Hmm. All right. Our daughter has a romantic side to her. Give us a poem that you think is going to melt her heart. Poem. Baby, you are all I ever wanted. Ah, uh, God, I messed up. Sorry, guys. Uh... No, I'm not really good at poems. Right. <laughs> He's just not even going to do it. What's your daughter's name? Hannah. Hannah Banana. I will blow your mind. Hannah Banana. I will make you mine. 
<laughs> Banana. Your daughter, she'd love me because I look good. I mean, honestly, don't I kind of look like Tiger Woods? You know I'm not simping, just on some pimping. After I hit, the girl, I'm finished. Fast. Okay. <laughs> okay, why should we pick you to date our daughter? Because I'm honestly probably 10 times better than the man she's with now. I'll change your life. I'd say that I'm pretty well balanced. I like this. Oh. Oh. Okay. Hey, I know she likes it. That's why you should pick me. Then moving right along and real okay. fast. <laughs> yeah. I think I'm pretty attractive. I'm in kickboxing, so I can defend her. I'm a cuddle bear. I've been growing up to treat a girl with respect. I'm not one of the traditional. Okay, right, so he's not a traditional. He's a different kind of a. Yeah. <laughs> nice meeting you guys. Okay. Take care. Bye. Bye. It was nice, nice meeting you. you. See you later. You have a wonderful day. See you. You're sweet. Bye. It was nice meeting you. Bye bye. You gotta be kidding me. All right. I know who I'm gonna pick. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and pick that one right there. Okay. And I think I'm gonna go with um, this one right here. Okay. I think that's a good choice yeah, also. Yeah. I hope she likes him though. Me too. <laughs> So the guy that my stepdad chose is first, and I trust that he chose a funny guy because my stepdad has a great sense of humor, and I'm excited to see how this goes. I kind of feel bad saying that, but I think I might have a little fun. I'm nervous. I'm really nervous. What do you think Are you? Gonna take you? I have no idea. It better be somewhere good, though. I'd like to say it's been nice knowing you, but really it hasn't. And um, I didn't say the same to you. Goodbye. It's funny. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> new person coming in is going to be probably much more polite than you. What if I just hit him just once? Just let me just pop him one time. Please, make my day. It looks like we have somebody here. Yes. Hey, hey Matthew. Hey, good good to see you again. Yeah. Come on in. I chose Matthew because he seems like he is a very genuine kid. He was respectful, honest, something I think Hannah needs in her life. I want to introduce you to my daughter. Hi. Hi, I'm Hannah. So I just met Matthew. He's really cute. He has brown hair, which I really like. Seems to have a nice body. Seems to be built, unlike my twiggy boyfriend. Most attractive about Hannah would have to be her eyes. You're definitely easy to look at and very pretty. Hey. What up, Mike? Matt. He looks like a douchebag. He has buck teeth. He walks out like, hmm. Well, you ready to get out of here? Yeah, I'll grab my All right. All right. Mm, what an idiot. Get the door for you. Thank you. I like this guy. I did too. He was adorable. See if you're as cheerful as you were earlier. Where's your phone at? Let me see. Thank What's in your you. pants? Keep your hands off me, bro. What's that big old thing right there? Hmm, that's what your daughter said. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! <laughs> oh my god, then he has to like woo himself after he says something. I'm just trying to see the TV, God. Well, let's just see what happens. So for today, because I like physical fitness and I like to stay in shape and it's fun. We're going to go boxing. Oh, are we? Yes, we are. I don't think she's ever done that. She's such a loser. That's what you do to stay in shape. I stay in shape. I party. This is the place. Let's go up here. Cool. After you. Thank you. Walk her in first. Mm. What a gentleman. Something you don't know anything about. Wow. Sean, what's the word worse than douchebag? Michael. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Can I show you now? All right, let's start out with getting loose. Okay. <laughs> His shirt's so green. So? It's green. <laughs> All right. You know how to jump rope? Yeah. Just want to jump for a little bit, get warmed up. Okay. You look like your arms and your shoulders. What's next? Hopscotch? <laughs> oh my god, that's so clever. Did you just make that up? <laughs> All right, are you feeling a little warmer? Yeah. All righty. Let's get to it then. Have you ever hit a bag before? No. It's your natural skill. All right. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> what are you laughing at? Yeah, what are you laughing at? What? What are you laughing at? I don't know. <laughs> I didn't think you knew. Jeez. <laughs> what are you doing? Do that Talk again. That's about annoying. Come on. I know. Do that again. <laughs> Michael, you're... Crazy. I think I need some guidance. And right at the snap is when you want to hit the bag. All right, so jab, 
come across like that. Yeah, she's doing it. It's working. She's learning. She's learning. She's, huh. she's, learning. she's doing good. Uh, she's having fun, and he's adorable. <laughs> now let's go try Massa's speed bag. Okay, what's the speed bag? This is the speed bag. This is the speed bag. <sighs> What's the matter? What are you what doing? Are you doing? I'm adjusting my speed bag. Wow. Is that like You're like adorable. How sweet. Look at it, he's taking care of her. Nice gesture, you That's know? cute. You can beat me up? That's good. Same. Punch him in his face, make his teeth even worse. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <dude. laughs> He's hitting a girl. So you're letting your guy hit your daughter right now. Keep it up, I'm gonna hit a girl. Yeah, Booyah! Oh god. You're what? acting weird. Oh, 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 hey, 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 oh, hey, oh, oh, hey, oh, hey, oh, 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 Sit down. Whoa. Whoa. No reason to get hostile. I'm not hostile. Uh, yeah. Chill, dude. Come on, you got that. Go for it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's not boxing. That's pretty much standing and dry humping. Oh. No, it's it looks like not. they're having sex. You're letting your daughter have sex on TV. When you're getting beat up, you just kind of clench onto the person, pull them real close. Okay. I don't know if I like yeah. this. Okay. You gotta take it all out. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, knock them yeah. out. So, did you have a fun time on a date? How did I you did. like boxing? I liked it a lot. Really? Yeah, I did. Something you wanna do again or just. Look, I can see right down her shirt. You boxed your boyfriend when he's being a jerk? Yeah. He's not treating you the way he should? Yeah, I'll just beat him up real quick. Yeah, you remember that jab, jab, <laughs> cross. You want to know what hit him? <laughs> How did it come about? <laughs> like, watch. I know, your attention span. Uh-oh. Oh, there so. it goes. Look at this. Watch out, I might punch you. Really? <laughs> we'll grab our bags and we'll go. All right, cool. It's called the replacement. And what are you going to do about it now? I'm going to go look for outside. Screw go ahead. Guys. Good luck. Oh. Good luck. Oh my God, I really like this guy. I, I like him too. Into him. He's adorable. And this might be the one. Thanks, buddy. You can go home now, dude. Bye, thank Bye. you, I had fun. Bye. See you later. Bye. Come here, babe. This is on? No. So the guy my mom chose is about to get here. She's big on looks, so I know this guy's gonna be really cute. Think about all the other fun you could be having, other than watching this guy text message. So say whatever you want, you're just gone. I'm gonna go take a piss. So me come knock on the door when this douchebag gets here. Or she's gonna leave without you. Because are so hostile. Well, listen to him, he's so obnoxious and he's being so rude right now. Mike's not that bad though. He's not that good either. There we go. Be back, Kenna. I'm scared. <laughs> Hi, hey, how, are how are you doing? Good. See you again. Nice to see you again. Come on in. He shows Peter. I thought he was adorable. I thought he was friendly, outgoing, and he seemed to have a lot in common with my daughter. Hi. Hi. Anna. I'm Hannah. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. When I first met Peter, I thought he was really cute, and I noticed that he has gorgeous blue eyes. All right, so ready to go? Yeah. We're going bowling today. Bowling. Oh, yeah, that's great. Like that. Should be lots it's of fun. Anna seems like she's a pretty crazy girl. She has a piercing right here. I think it's called the Monroe piercing. It was the first thing I noticed, so let's see where that takes us. Bye, Bye baby. Love you. See you later. What's up, man? Hey. Nice to meet you. What's up? Bye, baby. Hey, babe. Love you. Hey, I didn't wash my hands, by the way. Oh, my God. The dude's short. Hannah likes her men in a man size, not no economy size. He's like five feet tall. He wears V-necks. He has a baby face. I know Hannah's not going to pick him. Well, let's well, see what happens. So here. long, I'm here, buddy. I'm here for good. I'd like to say it's been nice knowing you, but really it hasn't. And... Welcome to Lucky Strike Hollywood. How are you? Are you waiting for two? Are you having trouble? Uh, yeah, I'm not really too good with technology. <laughs> All right, uh, let's pick out bowling ball. He's a bright one. Okay. Dude, he spelled her name wrong. Well, that, the H doesn't fit in there. Uh, look how long his that. name is there, darling. I'm, I'm, I'm an idiot and I don't even do that. You said it all yourself, Mike. Good one. <laughs> oh! <laughs> <laughs> she tried. That could have been really bad. Oh, man. Fingers and balls. <laughs> I don't even know what that means, but it's funny. <laughs>
I'll give you a lesson. Okay. So try to keep your arms straight, put your whole body into it. Look at he's teaching her how to bowl. I know, isn't that sweet? This is the best <laughs> date ever. Okay. Oh, she got a strike. Oh, I got a strike. Woo hoo, Hannah. Good job. Thanks. Good job. Wait, wait. Oh, yeah. Wait, you can't even dance. I love you guys. You're not going to be able to tell us you that guys very much make longer. Out? Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. Out. Save that for your little friends. Yeah, what if Hannah came back and we were three making out? Oh, that'd be horrible. And oh don't even gosh. talk like what that. The heck? That's not even funny. I'm going to be totally offended. I already am. <laughs> that'd be so weird. What other physical activities do you like to do? I've always wanted to do, like, yoga, but I've never really done it. Well, back in the day, I've taken a few yoga classes, and this is a position I learned. What? What? What a weenie. That's good. That's crazy. You really think she's gonna pick a weenie that you guys picked out? Uh, no. Who won? Uh, it's like I do. Are you hungry? I am. Let's go grab something to eat. All right. Right here. A couple of slices here. Awesome. I'll slide this right in right here for you. Cheese melted, bro. Oh, dude, I'm starving. Don't nachos sound awesome right now? Will you please make me some nachos? No, I'm not going to. Chill out, buddy. So, uh, do you know what you want to do in your order? I do. I want to be a coroner. What exactly is that? Uh, the people who do like autopsies on like dead bodies. What do you want to do in your order? Well, I'm hoping that I can eventually make commercials. Oh, awesome! That sounds like a lot of fun. I could uh, market your dead people. What? So, uh, do you want to head out? Yeah. All right, did you have fun today? Yeah, I did. I had a lot of fun. Thank so you. Did I. Try to make some nachos. Go ahead. Go make some nachos. Don't mind and if I do. It. Go on. Go make them. Don't and mind don't if I do. Don't come back in here either. No, they don't have any nachos. Or cheese. Or chips. <laughs> Where are the nachos? Nachos are underneath the sink. Damn it. The nachos are in the garage. <laughs> Seriously, where are the nachos? I, I put them in the car down the street. So I have to make my decision, and I really don't know what I'm gonna do. I met two really great guys. My boyfriend's awesome, but I'm starting to see what my parents say about him. I have to think a lot about this one. The chances of Hannah dumping me are very slim. I know she loves me, and I love her. I'm not worried at all. has a great future ahead of her. She's going to college. And then here she has Mike, who has no intentions of going to college. If Hannah stays with Michael, I think our entire future is at risk. There will be no more Hannah. It'll be all about Michael. She's a beautiful person. I want to see her develop into the lovely young lady that she should become. I just want to let you guys know that I had a really great time today. This isn't easy, but I have to let one of you guys go right now. Peter, I had a great time on our date, but you're a little shy, and I don't think I can listen to you talk one more word because you're kind of boring. Sorry, but I'm gonna have to let you go right now. Your loss. She said I was boring? She was talking about dead people. That sounds pretty boring to me. Matthew, you're really outgoing and you're super handsome, but you were borderline groping me, and that is not okay on a first date. And Mike, you know I think you're cute, and you make me laugh all the time, but everything's always a joke to you, and I wanna be taken seriously sometimes. This has been a really tough decision for me, but I've made up my mind. And the guy I choose is... Mike. No! Oh, man. Are you kidding me? I'm not terribly upset by Hannah's decision. She's not the typical girl I'd date, but she was fun. Well, I think Hannah's choice was a little disappointing. I was looking forward to her maybe trying a new boyfriend, getting some new ideas on how boys can really treat you well. I hope that Hannah learns that she doesn't have to put up with it. I hope that she sees that she can put this guy in check, 
and teach him how to treat her respectfully. That's right. I'm glad that I chose to stay with Michael because I love him. He's a great guy. And I'm extremely happy because I love her with all my heart and I know we're good together. I love him. He's awesome. <laughs>